Good morning from Disney Springs. That's where we're headed today. We decided that we wanted to try out the Olaf chocolate bomb from the Ganachery store. I don't know if you guys have ever been there, but the Ganachery has amazing like gourmet chocolates. They're super expensive, but they're worth it. You just get like six of them or three of them and take them home and like nibble on them all day because they're really, really good. But they have an Olaf um, chocolate, hot chocolate bomb. Is that what it's called? Yes. There's Carlos. Um, we want to try it. We tried to get it yesterday and it was sold out. We could not get it yesterday. So we're going to go today. They said to arrive by 10 a.m. It is now 10, 12. By the time we parked the car, Mm, I'm thinking that we have a pretty good chance. We'll be there at like 1030. So we're right outside Disney Springs right now. And um, what do you think, Carlos? What are our chances? I think our chances are good. You said get there between 10 and 12. You know, we'll be there about Oh, 10 and 12? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. We should be okay because they only make a certain amount every day. Yeah, there's only a certain amount of them every day. So we're going to do our best. If not, we'll have to come back to Disney Springs tomorrow and try again. The, I hear that the Olaf chocolate bomb is like enough to give maybe like four cups of hot wow. cocoa so nice. we have six kids and i bet you they won't let you buy more than one because they're such a specialty oh, yeah, item yeah. so everyone will have to have a little little cup of hot chocolate we don't want to take all the olafs but we are excited to try it and then we're going to hit up the uh, wonderful world of disney over there because i really want to get a monorail train and last time we went they had just put them out but uh, we saw people walking around with them but the line was so long to get in that day it was like um, thanksgiving or something yeah. so we we're like we're not going in there we're not doing it but today we're gonna go and just see if they have them and see what they have out for Christmas yesterday we were at Disney Springs and we were eating and Carlos mentioned that there are a pair of Disney ears that are a thousand dollars and I'm like what why are they a thousand dollars he said they're gold but he read all like because we read all of the Disney um, Facebook groups and stuff like that, and I guess apparently people were kind of complaining because I don't know what was what was the guess, ratio of plastic. Yeah, like sixty percent. Sixty percent of it is plastic, which you you would think it would have to be. Right. But I don't know who would wear a thousand dollar Mickey ears. I would yeah. like run I mean, those. They're all gold, so. Yeah. It's, it's a thing. It's a fiftieth anniversary here, so. Well, I would run those right over to Michael's, and I would have them like. <laughs> put in a, a frame yeah. you know so when you come to my house you're like oh there, there's those mickey ears that were a thousand dollars because i love to collect mickey stuff so it doesn't matter if it's a dollar or ten thousand dollars i'm like we love disney so for us it would be like like a decor item not a wearable item but you know i know not everyone has a thousand dollars hanging around the house and i don't blame you if that's like something you'd want to complain to mickey about hey you know it's not that friendly to <laughs> put that big a price tag on it but you know there's always that specialty item that some people will go after but he also said yesterday that they were sold out maybe they'll restock them I don't know but I'm thinking there's probably very few that are actually made yeah um, they're probably all on eBay now now they're on eBay for two thousand yeah, dollars so you know Merry Christmas <laughs> but the other thing that we're gonna do today is head over to Target because I felt like a Grinch a little bit I didn't put up a tree this year because we are actually moving from Disney um, celebration area to, to a new place. We're trying to stay in celebration, but the fact is it's very hard to find a house in celebration. We have to be out of our house in about 30 days. So I didn't want to take out the tree and the ornaments and all the Christmas stuff. And we have buku amounts of Christmas uh, stuff. Yeah. We've been collecting Disney Christmas specifically for five six years together i mean yeah. and i'm sad you're I, sad i didn't get to decorate this year i normally do big i know he puts up lights he like challenges himself to be the bigger, the, yeah. the bigger be bigger is better uh theme <laughs> uh with the neighbors so like whatever big the neighbor went he goes bigger and like he thinks that, better so but i love his enthusiasm for it i i do um but i told him no this year so i <laughs> i'm the grinch 100 percent. i know that self-awareness i'm i dropped the mom ball you know and I, I know i did and um i'm able to apologize to um all the children out there whose moms are skipping <laughs> Christmas. <laughs> I really did fail this. So I'm going to make it up. We're going to Target. We bought some ornaments while we were there. We put them on our little house plants around the house. I realized that wasn't that wasn't the wasn't best either. Enough. So we're going to get the artificial <laughs> fake tree. We got to yeah. get two. We're taking one to the Riviera mm -hmm. for Christmas Eve and Christmas. And then we're going to have one around the house. So I'm trying to make it up to you guys. I apologize. 
for losing my Christmas spirit while living in Celebration, Florida. It's crazy. Right. Yeah, it's okay. Hey, it's, diff it's, it's difficult because we're moving, but it'll be all right. We'll have fun. Yeah. It's exciting. So let's go see if we can get Olaf. Let's go do I'm it. I'm excited. All right. All right. You think we got it? We got it. High five. We got all this right. team. <laughs> Teamwork. Let's go. Look at there is the Disney Springs oh, hot air balloon much. up. It's a gorgeous day. Gorgeous. But guys, okay, behind me I'm gonna point out. You see that long line over there? That is for Gideon's for the cookies, and that's why I still have not gotten in Gideon's. Yeah. You have to really put aside uh, at least. Yeah, be here person. What do you think, Carlos? Now. Like an hour or two? What to get into to Gideon's? Get, to get into Gideon's oh, yesterday I was. was I mean, I'm, 45 minutes. Yeah, I mean that's at least the same or at least an hour to get in there. And those people have probably been here, they probably just opened at 10. But I bet some people are in their line at 9 a.m. Oh yeah. In there. Sometimes so. there's a view, virtual queue you could do, right. but we've just never used it. And like we're kind of average people, we don't. But they said they change it every day. Some days it's a virtual query and some days it's not. So I guess today it's Is not. Is it query or? Queer. Queer. Query. 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 Um, query or? How do you guys say it? Comment yeah, like, down below. Um, let us know who's your uh, query. Is that right? Or? Query. But you said quarry. Is it quarry or query? No, query. Query. <laughs> sorry, sorry if I said it wrong. No, I don't me. know if I'm saying it wrong. I don't it's know. like a legit. Like I don't know. Let's okay, so off. we're gonna head over here and we're gonna try. I don't know. To um. Get into the ganachery. We're going to the ganachery, which is past this. So like, past there shouldn't be a line for it. Right. But we've well, never come early in the morning. So like, maybe there is. We just have never like personally come here and just for something specific like that. But we're gonna try and do more of that because we keep missing out on the special offerings. So yesterday we got the cake. Um, the 50th celebration cake. Oh One of these days we'll come over here to Gideon's. And then of course, um, we're gonna try to get this Olaf chocolate bomb. Let's see if we can do it. So I'm standing in front of the ganachery, which is right here. It's located here at Disney Springs and they have the finest chocolates you can imagine. This is where the Olaf chocolate bomb is. So wish us luck. We're gonna go in. Gia? Yeah. I, I hope they have one. I they have one. I don't know. We're at 1039. Let's find out. All right. So we're here early. All right. Let's see. Wish us luck. We're going in. It is the Olaf mm -hmm. uh, hot cocoa surprise. I guess that's what they call it. Do you know your test? So we got two of them and it's two for guests. Mm -hmm. So it's a limited amount. Yeah. Yeah. And then I think we're also going to get this one below. Yeah, so we're going to get the Mickey Santa Pinata. We've got it once before, but it didn't have any marshmallows. Oh. So we're going to see if this time it has some marshmallows inside of it. Okay. And you get the little um, hammer to break it open. But All right, let's go. Yep, and then this she has the Santa. And this one's the hot cocoa. Hot cocoa. Good job, guys. High five. High five. We did it. Uh, don't leave me out. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. We did it successful. We came nice and early like they told us to. And it looks like already. Well, I'm sure, you would say, I mean, it's so it's been 50 minutes. It looks like they make maybe 20. And there's already five gone. Five gone in 50 minutes. I saw some people come in too and the husband was like, we'll just come back later and get them. And I, I should have probably said something, but I didn't want to say anything. Don't, like, I recommend, <laughs> I recommend you do it now because they won't be here later. But yeah, they make about, it seems like 20 a day. So I would definitely get here, like the guy said, between 10 and 12 and we'll walk away with maybe two. Yeah. Okay. Full day. Now we're going to head over to the world of Disney and attempt to get our monorail train. My Christmas. A little better. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> try, Wait, I'm excited. You're right. You I mean, try to celebrate Christmas a I little more than mom's it. been celebrating. I should have got him when you told me. I he, This guy doesn't I like to wait in sometimes. lines. Yeah. I'm so bad. you did what that guy did. We'll come yeah. back later. Dang. I, 
You're so right. Duh. See, but maybe it will be there. Let's cross our fingers. I, well, I might have been crossed for a couple <laughs> like weeks that we could get this because I mean I love the trains. I love yeah. the Mickey trains. And we and have stuff. last year's, but this year's different. But you know so. how you feel when you see the monorail go by when you hit um, yeah. Magic King, any of the parks. You it's see awesome. it go by. It's exciting. Um, I hope that they release boats and stuff too because we like taking the ferry and things yeah. like that. But it's true. Sometimes you gotta wait in line, like the Gideon line. Like it's gonna be an epic day when he lets me stand in the Gideon line to get a cookie. Well, I think yeah, I think we set to get here, be the first people here, and go straight there. One day, Dad will let me stand and get in the, in the Gideon. We line. will get it. We will do it. I promise you. You hear? He said he promises. All I right. Promise. All right. Okay. I show him back the vlog. <laughs> so what? He, she show said, show this part of the vlog to remind me that I promise you. Okay. Yeah. All right. Good job. Thank you, Gia. Right. Gia Gia's, has my back Gia's all the time. good, man. This girl, she's good. <laughs> all right, guys. Off to the world of Disney. There we go. You can't tell, but it's kind of mid-morning here at Disney Springs, and there are a lot of people behind us, but it isn't crowded at all. It just happens to be over here by World of Disney because it's World of Disney. Yeah. And if you guys can tell, the doors are open to it, which is super cool because usually you have to stand in a line, and it takes, I don't know, anywhere from... 15, 15 minutes to an hour sometimes yeah. to get in and the doors are currently open which is another reason to take time on a pool day or a day a down day to come here early before the restaurants are open and you can you know hit up the ganachery you can hit up Gideon's you can hit up World of Disney without having to stand in the line so I'm hoping that we can find the monorail train I really hope I hope I'm so nervous I really I saw it I keep seeing people post it too I should have got it already. You should have got it, but it would have meant standing in line for probably an hour that day. Because it was like Thanksgiving weekend that we saw when they started to display them. I know. But I love Disney. I should have done it. I know. Hopefully. Are you a fan? I'm a big fan. Are you? Yeah. Hmm. Come on. I wear nothing but Disney every day. It's true. He wears Disney socks. My phone case is Disney. Disney My shoes. My watch is Disney. Disney. Disney shoes. Everything. This guy's like a fanatic. I, I don't know. But like, I moved here. I moved the family here to Celebration Florida specifically because I loved it so much. So my heart's still in it. Of course. I'm still in it. So let's go check it out. Let's see if we can find the monorail train. If we can't, we'll just have to try another day. But I hope they have it. Here we go. That's the joy of living 10 minutes from Disney. Exactly. All right. pretty good we did all right we got some stuff though. we did get some stuff we got holiday stuff yeah. but the monorail was gone and it was so, only here the one day they said, they said yeah there's only been one shipment with it on it and the day that I saw it yeah. all we can do is pay attention and you know maybe, maybe there'll be one more you don't know before Christmas could be a Christmas well, I'll miracle take it after Christmas too I don't care yeah, I hope that we true. do find it though but they said one shipment came in and that's it and they I did see them over at Disney um, Magic Kingdom. Oh, Magic Kingdom. But yeah. you'd have to walk around with it all day or yeah. ship it home. Yeah. We'll see. Let's, let's, yeah. I'll pray for a Christmas miracle. Yeah. It's like that elusive Starbucks mug. Yeah. And C. Oh. That's a big, that's a big A. That's a big one. Okay, right, let's well, go see. I doubt that they have ears are there. Well, I don't know. I mean... Or maybe something else will be there. Something else new. Like, we did find some <laughs> things. <laughs> Carl's just like, we came here for one thing. I was like, but there's so many things, so... Here we are, by uh, World of Disney. We'll see you later on. I'm gonna go in the market co-op because they have like a lot of the cool 50th edition things. But um, we can still get them online because we just looked them up, so you can still get them. So the ones that are $1,000 are the full like Mickey oh. ears, you know, the hat. And then um, for $750, you could get the ears. So you can still get it online if you want to, but we're just gonna check here at the co-op marketplace just to see what they have in there. And if not, we'll probably order them online. And I'm privy to the ears versus the hat, the old school, but um, they're really special. So I think that it might be something I would personally invest in. I think so. I mean, I, we have a we have a couple of them, a yeah. couple ears, but I think this one, 50th anniversary, is it's a big deal. So yeah. we can't get I'm it just, here. We'll order online. I'm sorry I even interrupted you, but I just saw people were selling the 750 ears for $1,200 <laughs> online already. I'm like, what are you guys crazy? You can still get them online. So. Yeah. Just imagine if you hold those for 50 years in your family, what something like that what might down. not even monetarily mean, but like what it would mean to your grandchildren who hopefully continue to love Disney long after you're gone. Yeah, I That's hope so. my play on trying to get Carlos to buy them for us. So. 
So let's go see I don't if know. we can get them. He's like, I don't know about that. Yeah. But anyway, would you think Gio, you would like to have those? Yeah. Would you and the kids fight over who got them? Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Definitely. Right. We have to put that in the well. <laughs> All right, let's see what's in there. Okay. major score to me because the last couple times we came in here they didn't have it so if you love lunch boxes you can grab one of these two per guest do you want to get them now which ones the the one? yeah yeah let's get them so we're gonna go ahead i guess and get the ones that are 750 we're gonna do a thousand which i call a big Things, like a hat, a thousand, I don't... Those are so cool. Awesome. Take them? Yeah. We'll take them. Okay. Uh, and then I, we'll take a backpack too, please. Backpack? Okay guys, so we cut off and then now we're back on because mom decided to go on the bigger one too. So I'm going to end up being bald ones. Do you want me to open this for you? Or? No. Okay. Is there a password for discount on these things? Um. That's the question. Yeah, it's like it. Oh my gosh, that's awesome! Let's see, see your password. Okay. Do you have your pass? I have mine. Oh. Your wallet. Do you have the wallet? Oh wait, here. Uh, yeah. It's in there. Let's see it. I don't, I try not to leave home without it. Amazing. If you're going to get a discount on anything, that would be this right now. Yeah. Okay, so, so today went as expected. I didn't really expect to find the monorail train, which I was surprised. They told us that they, the only shipment they got was the one shipment that I saw that day, which I feel like was Thanksgiving weekend, but I can't remember exactly. So I'm really not surprised. It was really super, it was like, it would have been like a two hour wait, I feel like to get into there, maybe an hour to two hours. So we skipped it, we didn't get that, but I bet we could find it online, but it'll probably be three times the price. But I bet you come like um, January, February, they have those stocked up again. Um, Carlos, how do you think the day went? Like, we didn't get the monorail train. Right, so it's a little bummy, but I mean, we got the Ola chocolate bomb. Got two of them. Two of them. We got the uh, Santa Mickey pinata. Right. And then we, uh, getting the ears, I think it's awesome. And the backpack. When I, he says the ears oh, and the backpack, oh, yeah. guess, like, we did not expect to find those either, but we were present, like, pleasantly surprised that we found them not at the like world of disney which you don't usually find the like high-end items in world of disney you would think that you would but you don't so if you haven't been to disney springs before if you head toward um i want to say like the back entrances yeah yeah right yeah it's there's no parking the garages over there right? right the buses don't drop you off there no, no, either. yeah no it's on, it's on the other side so where you park you got to go to like the other side, it's, past World of Disney. It's where the Bibbidi Bobbidi Boo Boutique would be, and it's also where the trains are. They have these like specialty Disney shops. One is a toy shop, which to me, they just have kind of average toys in there, yeah. but they have maybe a few that you might find only in the park and not at the World of Disney. Um, they have also a place that's just like the, I guess they call it like, it's like their trendy clothing. Yeah. So like the dresses and um, some of the cool like women's items, they don't Retro have- Retro items too, I think. Yeah, they don't have a men's area in there though. Yeah, not in that one. And then they have the marketplace. It's called the marketplace, right? Yeah, marketplace co-op, I think you said. The yeah. co-op marketplace. Yeah. And the reason why it's co-op because they have different sections inside there and they feature kind of different items in there. Like they have right now the retro stuff that's coming back from the original Disney days. So I was surprised. We got two lunch boxes, which they've been sold out of those. They sold out right away. Before Thanksgiving. Yeah. They haven't had them. So they had maybe like 
40 of them out and you could get two so we got two one for us and we'll save one for the kids in the future um the what do you call them the drink containers that go yeah. inside the lunch boxes which you have to buy separately we got those two and back in the day when we were kids those things came together but now they come apart and then then we were checking, checking out, out thinking there's no ears there's no ears no, no gold ears gold, anywhere nothing. you can only get them online and then we were looking and people online are selling them the 750 dollars ears they're selling for 1200 and then the the actual like full mouseketeer hat is a thousand dollars and people were selling them for like two thousand mm, so shame on those people but they had them as we were checking out and i said oh my gosh are those available and the lady said yes and so i got the mickey ears and carlos got the mouseketeer hat and then we got the 50th edition backpack, which is super cool. So we will show you guys all of that um, after this. We'll just do a quick um, photo montage of it, a little video montage of it so you guys can see it. But they still have them. They're still available there. And they're a limited edition. And I, I would have to like research it. Maybe we can Google it. But how many are actually available to the public? We don't know, but we got we some. Try exciting exciting the backpack's cool it is i didn't even expect the backpack i wasn't thinking about it because they said it's been sold out everywhere that's the thing i don't i wonder if they maybe just got a shipment because everyone's saying all this stuff's been sold out but they were all three were there all now three. like you said the backpack looked like they might have grabbed like the last one like maybe there was the display and then the yeah, last one, the one in yeah. the cabinet and then i think we got the last i think mouseketeers hat because i didn't see another one when she opened the oh, thing okay. the um one. there are some like lounge fly ears too we didn't get those yeah those were like well, yeah they were like 225 yeah 225 yeah. we didn't get those they didn't look as exciting to me but they're there um but i don't they're really super soft the mouseketeer hat was really soft it they're like rhinestone edition ears did they look that different from the rhinestone ears that you can get at the park that are like you know 14.99 or 20, $29.99, I know they run up all the way to 50, but they didn't look that different, but they are special and limited, so. We support the mouse, we do love the mouse. <laughs> so we got them, we we'll, the maybe we'll wear them once to the park and then yeah. display them, display, display them. them. We'll We're not interested in selling them or anything like that, we no. just love. This is all for our, our big, big Mickey room we're gonna have one day that yeah. we'll share with everyone. Yep, so. All right. It was a successful day. Very Gia, successful pop day. your head up. Was it successful? Um, Where are you? She's, she's all seat she's belted in already. Belted. She's in the car. She's ready. Here she going. Hey. Well, what do you think? Was it a successful day? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We got everything. Did you get your Olaf chocolate bomb? Yeah. Okay. Is everyone in the car happy? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Very happy, excited. Mm -hmm. And now we got to go get a tree. Now we're off to Target to get yeah. a tree. So there we go. All right. So.